What's going on, guys? I just started YouTube. So, um, yeah, right now it's just going to be a Let's Play to start me off. And uh, I might do some scooter videos, too. So, yeah, let's see how this goes. Well, I got a cannon upgrading to level 6 because I just, like, got to Town Hall 6, like, not too long ago. And, um, I have this Archer Tower upgrading to, um, uh, level... Little click on it. Come on, dude. Okay, there. Uh, level 5. And then, I have my lightning spell. I just got done upgrading it to level... To level 2, like, yesterday. So, I got it upgrading to level 3 now. And, um... Yeah. Um, uh, I'm in Faux Clashers, so, um, yeah, it's a pretty good clan, I like it, I mean, I'm the leader, so, I usually take care of, like, all stuff, like, if someone's, like, acting like a goofball or something, I, like, demote them, like, they was putting a whole bunch of stuff in the clan description but okay me and Harley are pretty much topping the litter boards in here I was in gold 3 like yesterday but till this one kid attacked me which I'll show you it he had all f level 4 everything and I kind of got demolished it was a revenge attack so I lost a decent <laughs> chunk of trophies so, yeah. Elders free, cause, uh, earned by respect and loyalty and stuff. You know, attacking wars, it's pretty much all the rules there. And, um, yeah. So I'm gonna show you defense real quick. And then I'm gonna show you <laughs> the one that I got demolished on, and then I'll show you a win. So. Come on, bro. Okay, there we go. The wall breakers. <laughs> wow. That's what got me right there. Those level four lightning spells can really freaking go in. Wow. That's why mine are behind, because I didn't really think that they did that good, because I always had mine level one. But then my friend showed me some attacks with their, like, level 3s and 4s. So I'm going to go with mine to level 4. And then I'm going to upgrade John's to level 3. And then we're going to... Um, but before I do all that, I'm going to upgrade my mortars in the middle to um, level 3. Then the troop upgrades then we're gonna try and go for um town hall seven and see how that works so yeah i'm just gonna speed it up a little that pretty much sums up that defense he got me pretty good i mean two level four giants Five level four wall breakers, sixty level four um, archers, and then the rest is level four two barbs. You put sixty of those in, sixty goblins, and three level four lightning spells, which took my wizard towers and stuff out like horrible. So yeah, well I didn't want to replay that. Hold on. Alright, now I'm going to show you a win that I had. <laughs> One Barb King. 
I'll show you that one too, cause that one, I, I didn't see that one yet. Oh, uh, replay not available. Blah. Re available. Okay, we'll we'll replay this one. I'm gonna put this one a little fast, cause we just went through that entire one. Cause I'm gonna do an, an attack, so. Cause you see how the wizard towers do work whenever they're not freaking demolished. That's what I like about the dual um, mortars in the middle. They pretty much cover your entire base and they take out hordes of troops very easily because there's two, two mortar balls coming and hitting them. It's the best part. So, yeah. Alright, let me collect this, and then we're gonna do an attack. And then... Yeah, I'm a little low on resources right now, so I'm probably gonna do, like, look for a uh, town hall outside, because I'm gonna try and get back into gold 3. But, yeah, I'm a little ro low on resources, because I just upgraded that cannon in that orchard tower. And then with my elixir, I just upgraded that um, lightning spell to level 3. So I'm going to be down for a, like a little bit. Not much. Because I usually go for like 100 thousands. But sometimes that's hard to, to find with a um, town hall outside. Because that means that they're a farmer and they take care of their resources and collect them every so often. Eh, okay, let's do it. We got a little bit here. I mean, it'll work. Okay, let's go. Okay, so we're gonna scatter some archers out out up here. Take those out. Maybe drop some goblins for each side. And those archers are just gonna do work on that. I'm gonna spawn in these last uh, seven here to go in. And those archers took it out. Now we're gonna go for resources. So we're just gonna scatter some goblins. Oh crap, I didn't mean to do that, but. Oh, okay. There is no more. <laughs> oh, we got the 20% from all the things. Um, let's go for a little bit more. I'm a little greedy today. Okay. Take that out. Okay, and then we're going to come over here. We're going to scatter all these. Take those out, and then we'll leave. Do good. Here. I hate the hidden Telsas. <laughs> the hidden Telsas are real. Ooh, we two started. Nice. Very nice. Okay, we're gonna see if we can take out um this. Uh, elixir collector because I mean we only have seven archers left I mean we took out everything on the outside got the 50% which took out the town hall too so 
We two started. I think that's a pretty good raid. Oh no. So let's take out this. Ooh, we're gonna take it out. Flawless. Ooh, maybe we can take out the Archer Tower too. Nice. Okay, well, they're gonna die right here. Yeah. Okay, well, that sums up that raid. That was a pretty good raid, I think. So, yeah, 10 trophies. I love the war the loot bonuses. They are amazing. So, yeah. That's gonna sum it up for this episode. I may make one tomorrow, or maybe the next day, but... Yeah. Okay. Till next episode of Let's Play, I guess. I don't know. I might do some scooter videos, like I said. Maybe. Probably today. I'm because we're gonna be going to um, a skate park later today. So, yeah.